Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about Kaku Plus, the topic that is about limit. So now I want to show you how to answer. We need to do about factorization of this one. And this one should be like this. So, we need to find the value of 8 so that we can have the limit can exist. So that means in this one, we have number 3. We can put about coefficient go outside here. And I will put about s plus number 2 because this factor in here, they can cancel with this factor in here so the limit can exist. And now, I will put about S plus B. Now, the next one, I need to focus about numerator in here. So, we need to expand this one. So number 3, distribute for this one, this one, and we have like this. Now we need to compare with this one. So now we have number 3 and number 3. S, that is about number 6 with 3B equals to 8. And this one equals to 8 plus 3. So we have number 6 plus 3B equals to 8. And 8 plus 3 equals to 6B. So in this way, we can find the value of 8 because we have two equations and we have two variables. And now we need to arrange. So 3B, I will put in the right. This one, I will put in here. And now we can find the solutions of 8 and B. So 8 equals to number 15. B equals to number 3. So we need to go back in here. So we need to put number 3 in here. And we have like this. So the value of 8, that is about number 15, which is fine here. The question, they want to find the value of the limit. So in this situation, we have this one and this one, they cancel. So now we just have like this. So we put negative number two going here. And we have the final answer. And that is about negative number one. This is the end. Thank you for watching.